Finally, after all my time and research, I found the cap. Over there, tents. This must be the expedition's In camp. Indeed, it must be. It's also pretty shitty. Signs of combat. They were attacked. By the look of the tents in the campfire, it dates back several days. Indeed. Hello everyone, my name is Dane Rue. Welcome back to Greedfall. It's been a while since I played this. So, I'm still wondering what the hell I've been wondering. Perhaps they were wielding magic. Probably. Yes. It is the art of the Done Gada. One of the Valley Clans was here. Would you know which one? One who fights against the invasion of the peoples from your island. I can be sure of nothing more. Why would they attack scholars? They're not warriors. They come here as conquerors. This is enough. But they were not killed. Warriors would have been. Fair enough. This looks like scientific equipment. This must be the Lost Expedition's camps. Oh, yes. The, we didn't know that it was the campsite until now. Ooh, big book. Glo globular root has dense and firm texture. Afra, Jesus of Bird is heavily represented in the valley. This looks like the journal of a naturalist. There are sketches of flora and fauna. There is no doubt. We are definitely on the trail of the lost expedition. It seems that one of the team kept a distance from the others. Bear! Let's see what we can discover. Bitch! Fuck you, I got a sword. Oh, that was easy. Trail of blood. That cannot be good. Follow it. What's with the map? Ah. Oh, hey, there he is. Brutally fucking murdered. The clothes cannot be mistaken. It is a scholar of the Bridge Alliance. Indeed. From the looks of him, I would say he's been dead for days, as we already saw. Yep. This isn't the woman whose journal we found. There is still a chance that she remains alive. This man oh. traded his life for all the suffering of my people. It was <coughs> a scholar, a sage, not a warrior on the battlefield. Do you think my people see a difference when bridgemen steal our people from their beds? From who do you think? All the clans hide their children. Fair point. I lean towards Siora's point of view. The practices of these scholars also i got me a few drinks to enjoy along with this game because i'm sorry <laughs> some of the times this part of the story is a little bit weird i think we would prefer to go to war i'll search the body we might find something to help us understand hopefully a travel chest key Ooh. I can kind of miss the isolated camp mentioned in the jerk. Everything is in order, but the inhabitants are no longer there. I got a key. Its position would have allowed them to escape the attack. I have a certain opera. Arrival on the valley did not go unnoticed. The view over the valley is magnificent and makes it difficult for an enemy to approach without being seen. Indeed. It is a journal. That of a woman from the expedition, a certain Afra. She speaks Afra. of their research and relates here that she felt watched. She feared an attack was brewing. I believe she was right. The writing stops mid-sentence. She was smart. These people of the bridge have either just hatched from eggs or are complete idiots. Hey. The people are at war. They do not spare an enemy under pretext that they are not wearing the clothing of soldiers. We must follow the tracks of the attack. 
They will certainly lead us to our party of intrepid scientists. They better. Someone was right to fear the Donea Exregal. They must the have followed fuck? this path coming from the swamp. This is where we should go if we want to find these lost. Oh, that scholars. must be the couch that just arrived. Up, oh, wrong button. First things first, I just realized I've been wearing my same outfit for this entire time. A weak outfit! Gives me improved lockpicking, or not the improved power of science. Where is it? There it is. Oh god, my cape! Damn it! I keep hitting the wrong button. There we go. My case back to being normal. Okay, to the swamp then, huh? That sounds easy enough. The Donea Eskrigal. Barbaric creatures. How do I get to the swamp? Ah, that way. Easy enough. Or so I thought. Oh, I just happened to hit the wrong area. Here we go. Who fungus? Or Brusala, whatever. Hey, some pine resin. Could never go wrong with some tree resin. There's the hoof fungus I was looking for. Alright, so far it seems things seem to be pretty fucking dire. No shit. <laughs> I'm okay. Look, those are islanders. They might be from the clan that attacked the bridge account. We won't hey. let you take us. We will not kneel down without a fight. Hey, I'm just here to talk. Wait. We have no desire to fight. <coughs> we only want to find the Lion Sages. They are not warriors, but their chief is ready to send an army of warriors to liberate them. If you help us bring them back, you will save your tribe from a costly battle in lives. Indubitably. Truly. Look. One of them is already eager to bring lion warriors back to us. Hey. All we wanted was for them to tell us where our brothers are being kept. What good is this if we must leave our camp behind? Very well. Stay away from the main entrance. Our guards will not welcome your arrival. Pass around. There is a smaller entrance hidden there. The lions are kept in a home in ruins. There must be a key somewhere to open the door, but I know not where it is kept. Bullshit! Ah, potion. Pretty full. Hello there. Damn it, bitch! Tell me then, what is your intended purpose? We were sent to look for you. Apologies, but allow me to express my doubts. Hey! After this little swim, you could always try to pull the trigger. Thank you. Who sent you to find me? We were not looking for you in particular, but the entire expedition. It was Governor Burham who asked us to find you. He's worried about you. You haven't been reported. Things are pretty gone shit. You should have said that straight away. I must admit, I was hoping for a rescue of a different nature. Do you have a name? This Sardé from the congregation. Hmm, the new governor's cousin. Who wears an islander face. I've heard stories about you. And then? I am Siora, daughter of Vladnid. 
from the people that your own capture and torture. And never taken anyone. On the contrary, we had hoped to exchange our knowledge with your own. Bishop Petrus, if our young friend hadn't insisted on coming here, I would have gladly let you rot in this marsh. Hey! Behold the charity of the enlightened, huh? Huh, yeah. This is a rather odd group. I am Afra, a scholar from the Bridge Alliance. It is rather rare to find me rolling in the marshes. I study the fauna and flora of this isle. I should imagine you have many questions. Not really. But I guess I'll ask. The site where you were attacked. What exactly happened? We were taken by surprise. One moment everything was calm, and the next a war party of natives fell upon us. I had an uneasy feeling and kept myself apart. But when I heard my fellow scholars shout, I rushed over. And then you were chased away. The companions are incapable of defending themselves, and we didn't have guards to protect us. Sounds about right. Some tried to flee, but they brought him down. We decided to give ourselves up to avoid a massacre. I see. So what have you been doing since? What has happened since the attack? How long have you been in these marshes? We were taken prisoner and were brought to a village nearby. I was able to escape while the others were taken to a house that they use as a prison. I wanted to join the bridge <coughs> of the frontier post not far from here, but I wasn't able. So I doubled back to keep watch of the village from a distance. I have been hoping to find a way to free my companions without any success so far. Sounds about right. What about your research? Made progress in your search for a cure. Hmm. We were studying some quite remarkable plants when we were attacked. Great. Is rife in unknown and novel species. Some seem incredibly promising. Others the also seem incredible damning. These plants and they use them in their remedies. If only we had been able to converse with them rather than getting ourselves captured. Could you lead us to the village where your colleagues are being held prisoner? Certainly. We are oh so very close. And I fully intend to participate in this rescue. I'm not one to sit around and twiddle thumbs. Yes, you are. Come on. You're slow. You're slow, Afra. I assume up here. There we go. <laughs> he had to go first, apparently. This bitch. We'll speed her up. There she is. Oh, great. The cave. I like the fact that I could just speed her up by interacting with stuff after her. And then just run up ahead. Oh, what? I can't run ahead now? Bitch. This wouldn't be a bitch. A bitch who knows how to twirl. Hey, a campsite. Oh, I'll make a camp here. This is where the natives took your colleagues. Yes, it is here. These ruins are being used as a camp by the native raiders. Great. There are so many of them. Better to remain discreet. I have spied on the camp and discovered where my colleagues are being held. They are being kept in the old walls of the main ruin. Sounds about right. Let's set up camp. Good. I would rather avoid unwarranted deaths. We should wait until nightfall and look around the camp to find a more discreet way to get inside. Good idea! Okay. Move quickly, quietly. 
and expertly. Well, I was hoping for a quick and quiet movement, but hey, ex free experience. What the fuck was that? Easy. That was very fucking easy. Okay. Now begins my approach to this unknown and somewhat weary camp. Need to find a way around. There's gotta be a weak wall here somewhere. I, I can't do that. Damn it! I'm not intuitive enough yet. If only I had intuition. How long? How long till I can get that? Ah. 25. Two levels for that. Jesus. Wait. Ah, I have a better I have a better idea. I have two memory crystals. I can do this. Don't mind me, everyone. Just uh we'll skip forward a little bit. There we go. My skills have been reset. Let us sneak through. I get the feeling I'm gonna be caught anyways. We'll just keep on the move. We'll be quiet. These memory crystals apparently help me reset myself. We are taking the more direct sneaking approach, which is hilarious. Cause you'd think they'd be having that prepared. We'll just uh loot this on the way. Nice. Now we head this way. Aha! Don't worry guys, we're here! I could have just locked it to myself. I'm better at that. <laughs> Is that you? Come quickly. We don't have much time. Thank you for your help. Do not thank me yet. We are still in a shipload of danger. Indeed. Probably shouldn't be opening my map while I'm right here, of all places. We'll just uh, keep on the move. They haven't noticed me yet. And we will be scot free here shortly. Come on! That bitch is blocking my way. Okay, cool. Let us move quickly. 
They may be looking our way, but they she can't apparently see me. All right, let's sneak through this again. Now we must find a way to get out of this valley without putting my companions in danger. Oh, that's easy. How am I carrying too much weight to sprint? Ah. How far do we need? Okay, we just gotta head back to camp. Easy enough. Damn it. I gotta reset my fucking... Abilities, apparently. Again! Oh, hey. There they are. They're all together and they're all good. They managed to sneak past all the enemies while I wasn't looking. Really? Mercy, you have defeated us. Spare us our lives. If you spare them, they will only hunt us down until we are all dead. Hey! Oh, you have our word. We have been bested. We will let you move on in peace. How can we trust you? You attacked our camp when we were not even armed. Hey! Savages. They had us caged like beasts. Hey! We only sought to learn where you have caged our people. Spared their lives. I beg you. They were only fighting to save the lives of those that have disappeared. Of course I have to spare them. Well. They're my Please. people. And I hope you keep your word. Thank you, Honor Manawi. I have spoken and I will honor my words. Kwa awalamseg. Kwa awalaseg. Yeah, fuck the bridge lines. We are no longer in danger. Thank you for your help, Dasade. I must admit, the reasons for my being here are not entirely selfless. Yep. The research to find a remedy against the Malachor could save many lives in our cities as well. You Fair speak enough. like a true man of science. Cut to the point. Then you'll be thrilled. Your heroic efforts to save us from those savages could help. We've made a discovery. Oh? Is that right? In that case, we need to speak with Governor Burham immediately. Very well. I'll accompany you. Let's be off. Hey, we're back at Hickman. Great. Great. I find it hilarious the fact that we got a person who knows how to throw bounds. Sir Desade and our expedition. I thank you sincerely for having brought them back, Excellence. You are a providential man. Please, sir. It was you who convinced me and my cousin of the capital importance of their research. A research that has borne fruit, Your Excellency. Good. Truly. Finally, this some good news. news. You have found <coughs> with sufficient properties. Uh, not exactly. Know that during our captivity, an island woman visited the camp. The natives called her Tiena Hack Cadactus and treated her with utmost reverence. Ooh. I heard them talk about a remedy, a universal remedy, it seemed, that she had concocted. How's that? Huh. Well, I grasp the basic of the local tongue, and I am certain to have heard the word yag, remedy. Surprising. But the Tierna Hach is very powerful and very wise. That they are. It is possible that she did craft such a remedy. Oh, Alpha is joining us. Okay, uh... Petrus, we'll just have to leave you behind for the moment. Hey! Ah, uh, okay, I... When did I learn how to pick up one hand of... 
Okay, uh... Quest for a panacea. Hmm. I still need to fucking... Put off all of my crap. Because I should not be carrying this much items. Where the fuck do I live again? Ah, just up ahead. That's good. The very least good enough for me. We'll go there, drop my shit off, rechange my stuff again, back to normal, and then we'll be off. Oh, it was just a little further ahead. Damn it! Also, I'm sorry if my microphone peaks at times. I need to change the volume just a little bit slightly. I don't want to be too quiet, but I also don't want to be too loud. Alright, let's finally get ourselves home. And let us time skip ahead. Alright, now that I've restatted again, let's head this way. Ha <laughs> ha. Damn it, I'm still carrying too much to sprint. You know what? Shit, fuck it. Time to sell stuff. Uh, sell my monk ring, that. Ooh, stone axe. There we go. Much easier, just get rid of these. And all of these. Much better. And now I would like to purchase some stuff. All your ammo. Your health potions too. Ooh. Oh, my current sword's greater. Ha! But that, but that Crusader's ring, it calls to me. Did you get something better? Ooh, the lined cape of Teleme. Oh, hey, my journey's ready. Let's go. Ah, there she is. Is Elden Varghese. We need to talk. Hey. <laughs> uh. <coughs> But I insist. Yeah. 
Did I want anything else? Uh, see you later. <laughs> uh oh, I didn't realize my thing. My thing got screwed. Hold on a second, people. My game screwed up for a quick second. There we go. I don't know what the fuck's been going on about it. Thanks. Goodbye, Sel. Bye, Sel. Gaia Sarad, Dedra, and her Sengedi Nanadas will fight against the Sol Lasser, who torture and kill our brothers. Indeed. She is asking us <laughs> to fight alongside her. To set our people free and stop these monsters. Shall we rise monsters. to our goal? Our spears will rise in defense of our people. Yeah. Is done. Let's raise our spears and leave for battle. You can leave with a peaceful mind. My warriors will fight alongside yours and dead. We will meet near the camp of the Sol Lesser. Cool. That's a good thing that I did not. That I did not talk. That I did not bring uh, our dear friend Petrus with us. Bridge, bridge, the bridge alliance wants to talk to me. Me! How desperate can they get? <laughs> She's about to help with an invasion of the or against the Ordo Luminous. Hey, we're here. Almost at the camp of the Solasser. Should we wait here for the moon to rise? Of course. Yes, let's. There you are. And I see that you have brought the Gaius Rad with you. We could not let the Senged in Anadas take all the glory. I wouldn't expect anything less of you, Ezeld, daughter of Bladmid. Our objective is located beyond this cliff. The Inquisitors are not expecting us. We have the element of surprise. Let's make good use of it. We will be as discreet as a group of docentats. They won't hear us coming. They Let's better not. Vantage point to get a better overview of this fort. Agreed. So, this is the place where my people are being tortured. I hope we're not arriving too late. Eh, you might Most have. Of their troops seem to be Ooh. outside, as if they sense we are coming. The prisoners are most likely inside. Good. In some basement, perhaps. And it seems as if there are some in the right wing as well. In that case, the toughest fights will take place outside. That is where I want to be. Careful. We must strike quickly if we want to make good use of the element of surprise. Have you thought about how you'd want us to conduct this assault? We are behind the camp where there are fewer guards. Getting inside will prove less troublesome from this side. Indeed. We will conduct two near simultaneous assaults. The first larger group will attack from the front to cause chaos in the enemy ranks. Good. As for me, my companions and I will get inside the building from the back and sneak into the basement. We will set as many prisoners free as we can and use the opportunity to search the building. Once you have eliminated the troops in front of the building, focus on the right wing. Then we obliterate it. This way we'll attack them from two sides simultaneously. Agreed. We'll conduct the first assault and then we will go back to intercept the ones who run away. Excellent idea. Are you ready for the assault? When it comes to setting our brother free, we are always ready. Good. In that case, conduct the assault as soon as you're in position. We shall obliterate them immediately. Hi there! Watch it, God, for me. Good. 
Bitch! That was easy. Take that. Oh, we ain't going through there, so we gotta go down here. Come on, what you got? Why? Why would you throw a grenade on right here? Again, she threw a grenade! <coughs> Why is she throwing grenades? While I'm in mid, while I'm in primary combat. Watch out, grenade! I'll just keep throwing it at you. Gotcha. Again. Ow. Bitch! Shit. Stop that. Loot, thank you. Ooh, Inquisition Soldier's Cures. Come on, what you got? <laughs> Bitch! Stop that. <laughs> Goodbye. Let's hurry and reach the prisoners before the Inquisitors kill them. Hold on. First, we get everything else from in here. Hello there! We intervened quickly, thankfully. Let's find the keys to these cells. Hold on. We got other shit to do. Ah, here it is. Stairs, huh? Oh, I gotta let them free. Lock. Wait here for now. We're still fighting outside. Cool. Now I can invade upstairs. And murder them all. Ah, there's a worker. Hello there! Get done blocking! Bitch! Hello. Let's see. I know I need to go upstairs more, so. More upstairs. There it is. Hello there. Why do you keep throwing grenades in close quarters? I think that was the last of the inquisitors. The forge is safe. We're done here. Let's lend a hand to our allies outside, as there are still some prisoners there. 
Don't worry, we're making our way out there. Downstairs. There we go. Huh. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Can't go over that wall. Damn it! Too chunky now. Okay, it's not that way. Gotta go downstairs, apparently. And through here. Hello there! Hello there! These prisoners have been dead for days. There's no one left to set free. Those fuckers. Damn. Well, they returned to the light, as they said. Damn it. And I hate the fact that I can't run right now. Oh, I could have just ran down to the side. Damn it. That's my bad. I'm sorry, everyone. I fucked up. We'll just uh, head out that way. How did the battle go for you? <laughs> we prevailed. Your plan was good on all Manawi. Congratulations. And we were able to set the prisoners free. They were completely exhausted, but alive. Do not worry. We will bring them back to Vedluk so their wounds can be treated. You have shown bravery and righteousness. I will not forget it. I hope to see you in the village again soon. You will. Don't worry. Now we go and expose the camp. Because that's such a good idea. Ooh, ambush. Am I about to be ambushed? Am I about to be ambushed? Ambushed? No. They just wanted to play music. Give me the rocks. Yes. Rocks. O okay, game, what? Why are you trying to play up these things? You sure you want to do this? I got super armor at this point. Oh! Someone who knows how to fight with a sword! Well, that was too- that was boring. Hey, bandit hat. Damn it, I hate having to only walk, though. I thought I solved my problem when I sold all that stuff. But apparently not! <coughs> apparently, I still am overweighted. By what? Who knows? Who knows what the fuck I'm being overweighted by? 
You know, we'll just dodge our way through the city. I remember that the Admiral sent us to find someone called Fernando during the conflict between the Norks and the Ordo Luminous. He could probably help us. He might be able to. But first things first, we roll. Because we gotta get to his place to sell our shit. All of our products are a boot. Don't hesitate to have a rummage around. Shut up. Sell all that. Ooh, bishop robes. But my but I now have the new armor. Plus my current one's still better than this. Science and lock picking. I don't want to get rid of either. Damn. Gonna have to find time to put one away. Get rid of the priest gloves and a, ooh, bishop gloves. I mean, I'm wearing captain's boots. So far, mine's pretty bad, much better. Ooh, Aegis metal. Damn it! Okay, what about weapons? You know the fact that this ha gets to have elemental damage. I'm kind of, kind of upset. So the great sword, so this rapier, so the steel foil. I'm good now. Thank you. I can run. Finally, I can run. I can be free. I can fight! Maybe I'll fight the Mother of the Cardinal. She might prove to be a challenge. Mother Cardinal! You want to go tussle with me? We can have some fun! Break your legs! Damn religious bent. Hear that! We your talk. Eyes. I salute you. Sir de Sade, what can I do for you? Uh, I have come to inform you of the crimes committed by the Inquisition on these lands. The Ordo Luminous captured and tortured many islanders in a secret camp in order to convert them. Most of them were executed because they refused to renounce their beliefs. Of course, I put an end to all this at the demand of Queen Deirdre, and the camp was dismantled. How could Good. such villainous acts take place without anyone informing me of them? Do you have proof of what you're saying? Oh, plenty. Indeed. Here. This should convince you of my good faith. I cannot believe it. May the enlightened devour these wicked things. <laughs> I cannot believe the Inquisition would continue their exactions after what happened to them the first time. But your excellency, it seems to me as if you have overstepped the boundaries. You could have informed me of the situation, but you chose to fight priests of Teleme instead. It was more fun. Trying to break the alliance between your nation and ours. Hey, no. I intervened at the demand of the natives, who are our allies as well, and would have come to inform you of the situation if I hadn't thought you might give more credit to the Inquisition than to these poor people. Agreed. You should have let me be the judge of that, Your Excellency. You underestimated us. Your fault, bitch. You wouldn't have helped. I didn't level up yet. Damn it. Well, no, I didn't. I did level up, but I didn't level up more. I need more power. All right. Honestly, I think that's probably going to be enough for today's episode. I did a lot, both on and off, and my recording device is being a bitch at times, so I kind of need to start trying to figure out what the fuck's going on with it. Maybe see if I need to get it replaced. But until then, I hope y'all enjoyed today's episode. Consider giving it a like. I'm sorry for the way I've, so I've been sounding as of late in these current recordings, but I can assure you, it's all in good faith and I'm just having fun. Then I, I have currently been recovering from being sick. 
But until then, I hope y'all enjoyed today's episode. Consider giving a like. Check out the Patreon link down below, and I shall see you all on the next video. This has been Dane Neru playing Greedfall, signing off. Later.